Alan Carr was back with his epic game show this weekend as the comedian presented a reboot of much-loved darts show Bullseye. However, ITV viewers weren't impressed with the remake as contestants answered questions and played darts for a chance to win big prizes. During Saturday's quiz, four pairs of knowers and throwers competed as they took on the questions and the dart boards. The contestants were fighting for a chance to win prizes in the epic endgame. Richard Ashdown joined the comedy to help keep the scores. The reboot of the classic game show included a new spinning dartboard for the final round. However, ITV viewers took to Twitter to comment on the changes to the bullseye format. TV Quiz World tweeted, Generally I really love hash epic game show, but they really should have left hashtag bullseye alone. I don't enjoy what they've done to the format and Alan Carr, who I normally enjoy, is not the right host. Breckier tweets remarked, thought hashtag bullseye was the format least suited to hashtag epic game show during its first series. And during its second. And now during the third. It just doesn't suit Alan and doesn't suit an hour of prime time on Saturday nights. Epic game show I was looking forward to this return but because you do one episode of everything, everybody wins all the time. So boring, no jeopardy, oh and you've ruined bullseye, at Steel City Mum one added. At Impartial Eyes quipped, there was nothing epic about the hashtag epic game show it is only the original that was smashing, super, great hash bullseye. Hashtag epic game show what is the point in recreating a classic if you then change the format. At Kurt 24,122,254 questioned. At Liam Meller 80 wrote, what's that rumbling noise I can hear? Oh, it's just Jim Bowen turning in his grave. Hashtag epic game show. Next week, Alan hosts an updated version of Strike It Lucky. Three pairs of contestants will navigate across several screens trying to grab prizes while avoiding the classic hotspots. One lucky couple will get the chance to win a trip to Las Vegas in the final.